today we're doing my day three of my Halloween fall makeup looks. I am really, really excited. And you guys, I cut off my hair like this because I like thought it looks so cute. Like, let me know in the comments if you guys like my hair, like my bangs and everything like that, like out on the side. This looks so cute. Anyway guys, so if you guys are bright in my channel, don't forget the Skype button for you guys leave. And also guys, make sure you guys click all notifications on because when you guys, that way you guys get notified every time I post new videos. And then also guys, if you guys get an email that says like my premiere and everything is, you guys actually get an email when you guys get notified of new videos. So that way when it goes up, then you guys can email and we'll let you know, like, hey, my video is actually up. If you guys missed it, it's still on my channel, so you guys don't need to worry about it, of the premiere of my videos and all that. But further ado, let's just go ahead and get started. All right, guys, so you guys know I am still working on is my brow products. The first one I just also put on today is my e.l.f. Man Brow Kit. I'm excited to add this to the empties because you guys know my video is coming really soon. So I will always include more empties and all that kind of stuff for January for next year. Hopefully, you guys, I have more empties this coming year, which I'm so excited about. But don't worry, you'll definitely see my December and video really soon, because right now I'm still kind of waiting for my home care to be filled up, and then I'll go ahead and do that one too. So this is what my brow kit looks like right now. Sorry, it's already used like right here, and there's still product here, product over here, but it will all, this entire thing, you guys, like there's like product everywhere in this Part of the can. In my video, then you'll probably see it in my upcoming future videos and all that. And you'll probably see more of these in my bus turn videos. So stay tuned for that one, you guys. I'm so excited to see what I'm getting really soon. And the other thing you guys know I always use is my Revolution Color Stay Brow Fire Filter Brow Gel. It's called 306 Clear Transparent. You guys know the reason why I keep using the same product over and over and over again because I'm trying to like go through my products and so I can add it to the empties and then talk about it for you guys, which I love to do for you guys. But this one is getting so close. Like, you guys can kind of see it. It's getting really, really close to being in my video. Very close. So when this one does run out, I'll go to a new one. But I'm not going to put a new one in, in here just yet. Because I need to wait until I get more brown gels. All right. So I'm going to grab my hairpan. Kind of just do a little hair knot kind of thing. My little hair out of the way. There you go. And then after that, and then after the end of the video, we will see back in it and everything. All right, so the next thing you guys know I'm gonna put on is my Tarte Time Smoothing Primer. I am so excited to add this to the end of the video. This is how much of this primer I have left. I can't wait to add this to the empties, but right now it's not even empty yet, but it will get there really, really soon. And then I'll start adding more new primers in my collection and you'll see old products of foundation and primers and everything. All right guys, so the other thing I'm actually really excited to put on, my Duo Eyeshadow Impact from Beverly Taylor. So I'm going to use this shade right here to use that my entire crease. Color 
right here and I use that my upper crease. And then also guys, I'm gonna use my Revolution there. And you guys, I can't wait to see this in a video in the future. I'm gonna use this gold one just for like my entire eyelid as a eyeshadow topper. Guys, so the other thing I put on is my Hard Cane Stay in Light Medical Eyeliner called Black Magic. I'm gonna show you guys how far I am right now. So you guys can kind of see, this is how much I have been working on for a long time. So I'm gonna go ahead and put on that off camera real quick and I'll be right back. Hi guys, so my eyeliner is on and I gotta show you guys this eyeshadow it looks so pretty and then you guys know I am still working on is my Stella Bella wasn't inspired be balm and strain mascara Also guys, this thing, this mascara right here, is getting the last end of this. So I'll probably put this in this video, probably like two more, like three more uses, and I'll put this in the video as soon as possible because I need more mascara so bad. I was makeup line. So if you guys ever love Stella Bella, you guys never, if you guys ever love Meluca, you guys need an organic mascara, this is the one I really recommend it. And then the other thing I put on is my Revolution Color Stay 2-in-1 Pat Makeup and Concealer. This is like a 2-in-1, so that way you don't need to travel concealer. But I can't wait for you guys to see this in the video really, really soon. I really wish they made these like a concealer because this is like a really good pot for a concealer. guys so the other thing I put on is my Hard Kitty Cheer Avi Translucent Loose Powder. And then the other thing you guys are gonna put on is my Elf Machine Rose Lipstick. You guys, I'm so excited to add this to the end video. This is the first time I've been working on this. Also guys, this is how much of this lipstick I have left. And then the other thing I put on is my Sassy Chick Lip Gloss. And 
then the other thing I put on is my Too Faced Mel Chocolate Salali Lomper Mate Bronzer. So if you guys want to know, this is how much right now my part of Japan I'm at. Our thing, you guys, I'm so excited to add this to the end video. This is my Laura L. Paris True Match Super Fenable Blush. It's called C3 and 4 Tender Rose. And then the other last thing I've put on is my Too Faced Ray of Light Highlighter. Very last thing, but not least, I put on my Nevin Beauty Rose Water Cell Spray. Oh my gosh, you guys, this looks like a Halloween look, like if you're doing like a fairy, but this is so, so pretty. And if you guys ever want me to create this makeup look again for Halloween, let me know in the comments down below. And if you guys want to know, I already have a list of all the videos that you guys want me to do. If you guys have any more suggestions, I'm gonna keep writing more playlists of videos and all that kind of stuff. If you guys absolutely love how this video turned out, then make sure you guys go down below, hit the subscribe button, and make sure you guys also ring that bell so that way you guys do not miss new videos every single three times a week, Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. But I love you guys all so much, and I hope you guys have an amazing day, and I'll see you guys in my next video.